You know, just whenever things are going pretty decent. Last day of school was yesterday. Me and Amanda were off doing their thing. They were pleasant because they have the summer off. I'm at home watching some Jerry, just enjoying the day. And well, I got a lovely phone call. Hello? Can I ask who's calling? Marissa who? I know what your last name is, Marissa. I met Marissa who as in it's been a damn year since you even, you haven't even called. Stop by, see how me if you and Amanda are doing. She calls and picks up like everything's just peachy here in Wonderland. Well, <laughs> where the hell has she been for a year? You better be here at 7. Not 7.06. Not 7.13. You better be here at 7, Marissa. Honestly. I'll make sure they're home. Alright, bye. So 7 o'clock came and went. Of course, there's no Marissa. I guess she's not coming, guys. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm sorry. I tried. Honestly, I really did. I tried to just, you know tell myself to be civil with her. But the look on me if you and Amanda's face is when they walked out that door knowing that their mother didn't show up. Sorry I'm late. Yeah, I bet you're real sorry, Marissa. It's quarter after eight! You says you were gonna be here at seven. I don't want to hear anything about your damn car troubles. Bullshit. No, they're not here! They wanted to go to their friend's house. They says, no. I told them to stick around because you wanted to visit with them. Got them all excited. And I let them leave about a half hour ago. So, no, they are not here. Yeah, that does give us time to talk. So, what? No, you cannot sit down. Because this isn't going to take very long. What do you want? Oh, you get in your own place? Good. Good for you. You can move out of that dope dealer boyfriend's house of yours. Don't give me this bullshit that he sells things on Craigslist, Marissa. He's a drug dealer. Everybody knows it. Well. You're, you, you got a lot of gall. You're going to come into my house after missing a visit with your kids for the first time in a year and ask me for $800 to borrow for a security deposit in the first month's rent. Get out. Get out of my house. Yes, I'm serious. Coming in here looking like stewed shit. Get out of my house. And she has the nerve to get lippy with me. <laughs> I got news for her. Yeah, you know what? You don't fucking tell me what to do, bitch. She doesn't know how close she came. Honest to God. Next time I see her, it's gonna get nasty. <laughs>